It is estimated that 5% of global CO2 emissions is due to shipping. So the reintroduction of wind power to international cargo ships is a move that could help reduce the high levels of atmospheric carbon. But the German ship MV Beluga Skysails is more than just a sailing ship. It uses a kite to take advantage of high-level winds that blow more constantly than air currents near the surface. Though it will not be completely reliant on its kite, the system will reduce fuel use by about 20%. Beluga Shipping is the first cargo company to use the system, developed by Hamburg-based Skysails. When not in use, the kite is stored below deck at the front of the ship. The small amount of storage space needed for the kite only minimally reduces the space available for cargo. The system is controlled from the bridge, with all aspects of the kite's behaviour controlled by computer. The system can be retrofitted to existing ships, and the Sky Sales Company aims to convert 400 ships by 2013. After the ship's maiden voyage, travelling just under 12,000 nautical miles, the system performed as expected and there are now plans to introduce a larger kite to further increase savings to 30%. Beluga expects that the sky sail will pay for itself in three to four years. The tether connecting the kite to the ship stretches as far as 500 metres to stay clear of surface turbulence. The SkySail company is continuing to trial the system on larger ships. <laughs>